today that we're trying banana pudding tacos. Am I saying that right? It feels very unnatural to say it. It doesn't feel right when I say it out loud. So, um, I regret to inform y'all that I did not taste banana pudding until my 30s. Some mistakes you can't recover from, and that is mine. Uh, I grew up in the South, in Southern Alabama, and I remember my dad always asking my grandmother and my mom to make him banana pudding for special occasions, and I turned my nose up at it. I assumed I wouldn't like it. I didn't want a banana flavored anything. I tried one banana runt, and then I thought, I'm done with banana desserts, and that was wrong. Let me tell you something, I feel like a skinny person came up with this. Cause us biggins would never mess with banana pudding. It was fine the way it was. Like it's already in perfect form that I could just shovel it into my mouth as fast as I want. And now we, I feel like we've complicated it and that's unnecessary. Okay, so I'm excited about the combination of banana pudding and tacos because I didn't immediately assume, oh, savory taco, sweet banana pudding. I just assumed the taco shell would also be sweet and it's just another vehicle for eating the banana pudding. Banana pudding is my absolute favorite Southern dessert. I think it's the perfect dessert, and I think it should be available at any gathering of people. I believe you can eat it anywhere and anytime. Like, I think it's 4th of July, bring out the banana pudding. Christmas, should have the banana pudding. Thanksgiving, absolutely. It should be at the center of the table, push the turkey out of the way. Tailgates? Yeah, weddings, come on. Divorces, sure. Tailgates for divorces, absolutely. And I also want to state that I have made banana pudding for a sketch video we did for So True, y'all, and there was a lot of controversy on how it came out because some people don't think it should have meringue, some people do. I like both, but I looked it up and it said the Southern way was with meringue. And you only briefly put it in the oven and there was a little bit of char on the top and everyone's like, your banana pudding's burnt. It was charred. It was still delicious. So I would just like to take this moment to be able to defend myself on that banana pudding. Thank you for letting me have that. Banana pudding taco, here we go. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get this all over me. <sighs> look, I mean, can we, come on, come on, look at that. There, hold on. I didn't, even, I didn't even get a chance to bite you yet. See, this is what I'm talking about. If this was a burrito, this would not be happening right now. Um, hold on. There's a guy in my mustache, I don't know. This just in, this banana pudding taco is good. I, I will say, I don't know that it's necessary to put the banana pudding in taco form, because it's sort of like a mess that we didn't have to have, you know, because I'm getting all the taste I would have gotten had I eat this, you know, with a fork, but. It's pretty, it's pretty, it's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, I wanna be mad at it, but I can't be. Um, oh, oh, no, I missed it. I would rate the banana pudding at like a three. I don't wanna insult the person who prepared this, but it's a little lumpy. I'd rate the taco shell, hmm. I was expecting crispy, so I think I would rate it like a four, but that's only based on my own expectation. And we all know expectations are just premeditated resentment, so I can't expect anything, you know? I just need to let somebody know, they're watching this right now, and they're like, oh, that's amazing, I'm gonna make that. And bring it to the next potluck. Hold on, hold on. This is one of those things that you absolutely should clear with the people at the potluck before you go showing up with this. Don't just show up like you signed up to bring banana pudding, and you show up with banana pudding tacos, and you didn't warn them ahead of time. You need, to, you need to clear that with them first, okay? Now you can bring this on top of something else, but if you're signed up to bring banana pudding, by God, you better bring the banana pudding. I'm just trying to save you some heartache, because let me tell you right now, you walk into that potluck with six of your friends and you bring banana pudding tacos and you're supposed to bring regular banana pudding, you will leave without six friends. Hey y'all, if you like this video and you want to help support It's a Southern Thing even more, then you're invited to join the potluck. You'll get exclusive swag, behind the scenes sneak peeks, special discounts on merch, and more. We'll save a seat for you.